first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory unto the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Basham Yoshai, Basham Kakadash. I'd like to give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone Ruel, who teach us truth through the Spirit and power, Yahweh Basham Yoshai. Peace and salutation to the Akims and Mori, pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth. This is Brother Quara from Shinnad Camp, coming to you with another lesson to feed the lek of the house of Israel. The so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American and Indians. Now, let's just start a little quickly with the teacher. Now, I'll entitle this lesson Our Lord going to be glorified again. You know, just as how we, well, you know, we glorify before the world began. You know, you're going to get back again. Right? You know, the firstborn son. You know, he's going to inherit the inheritance. Right? It's Romans 11 verse 34. He say, Or oh, who had first given to him, and it shall be recompensed unto him again. For of him and through him and to him are all things, to whom be glory forever. Right? There's John 17 verse 5. He say, And now, O Father, glorify thou me with thine own own self with the glory which I had with thee before the world was right so he he was shy you know he gonna get you know what was his right the Lord gonna make hey this earth you know hey the nations you know a footstool for his son the firstborn. Right? Let's we'll jump down to verse, 70, verse 24. He said, Father, I will that they also whom thou hast given me be with me where I am, that they may behold my glory which thou hast given me. For thou lovest me before the foundation of the earth. Right, so wherever where, where you are shy you're gonna receive of his father. He say we're gonna be we we gonna be there also, we're gonna be with him. Right? So just as how he endure long suffering and inherit right what is his we gotta do the same thing. For you gonna hey he, we gonna be a part of his inheritance. We're going to be a part of it. Right? Because we join heirs with him. You know, we're going to rule these nations. We're going to be a part of it. To rule our enemies. Right? The Revelation 3 verse 21, he said to him that overcome it, will I grant to sit with me? In my throne, even as I also overcome, and I'm set down with my father in his throne. Right. <laughs> but we gotta overcome. Hey, yo, shall I overcome? Right? And he sit at the right hand of his father. So if we overcome, we gonna sit with our Lord. We gonna be alongside with our Lord. Right, there's John 14, verse 23. He said, Yahweh answered and said unto him, If a man love me, he will keep my words, and my father will love him. And we will come unto him and make our abode with him. Right? If we eh, have faith in your Basham and keep his saying, keep his word. Right? Hey, you're a Basham Hey, you gonna, you gonna come on to us? Right? Romans 8 verse 17, he say, and, and if children, then heirs, heirs of God, and join heirs with Hamashiach, if so, be that we suffer with him, that we may be also glorified together. You know, in that, that crowning ceremony, you know where where just so what young person is this that crowned them 
right? Also high stature that crowned them. Right? He said, For I reckon that the suffering of this present time are not worthy to be compared with the glory which shall be revealed in us. Like it's, it can't compare. This place finished, like this flesh. Hey, where we where we going through? Hey, hey. Brothers, y'all enjoy it. Go through it. Be it. Have a reward. A beautiful reward at the end of this journey. Right? With Revelation 2 verse 26. He say, And he that overcometh and keep my keep my works unto the end, to him will I give power over the nations. And he shall rule them with a rod of iron, as a vessel of a potter, shall they be broken to, sh to sh sh shivers, even as I receive of my father. So he's going to receive the kingdom. Right? And we going to rule them with a rod of iron. We going to have that authority over the nations. Right? But we just got to go through the journey to receive it. Yeah, Shai went through his journey. We got to go to ours. Right? With Zama Solomon 3 verse 6. He said, As gold in the furnace had he tried them and received them as a burnt offering. And in the time of their visitation, they shall shine and run to and fro like sparks among the stubble. You might script to say, He so shall be the stubble, Jacob of flame. And he saw for stubble. He said, they shall judge the nations and have dominion over the people. And their Lord shall reign forever. Yo, Abasham, yo, Shai. Yo, Shai, he gonna reign forever. They go and no, no other, no other kingdom coming. Yo, Abasham, yo, Shai kingdom gonna be established forever. And ever. World without end. This is what coming, right? So you Israelites, the hopefully elect that believe and keep the saints in faith, in hope, we're gonna be alongside our Lord. We're gonna sit with Him. The Lord do lie, he cannot lie. <coughs> right? This is what promise. This is what promise unto the righteous. Right? Enjoy affliction. Who oh, strong? You know, with that, you know, hope it was very fine. You know, I like to give all praises and glory unto the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, Basham, Yoshai, Basham, Kakadash. Like to give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Peace and salutation to the Akiyams of Maudi who pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth. Is the Banakwara saying, Inshallah, one.